back to Andy. First three laps, there's going to be no overtaking, okay? And I'm going to want you to run at about 50%. So it gives you time to understand what you're looking at, looking for new RPs, understanding what the track actually does, okay? Um, like I said, no overtaking on the first three laps, so just be one bike behind the other. Um, when you finish those three laps, okay, I want you to stay out on track, but I now want you to use that new knowledge that you had to start experimenting with line. Okay? See what you can discover more. See if you can find a better line through the turn, or, or an alternative line through the turn. As long as you have good throttle control, then the line's good. So as long as you can start the gas, roll it evenly, smoothly, continuously through the turn, then you found a line that works. If you find a line where you are able to crack the gas, but have to hesitate or roll out, the line's not good for you. Okay? So that's how you're going to define if you found a better line or not. Does that make sense? Um, after those first three laps, overtaking is allowed again, but please take caution. Everybody's going to be out there experimenting, trying different things. So the person in front absolutely has the right of way on this drill. You're going to discover something very, very interesting about the track doing this drill. Extremely interesting. I'm not going to tell you what it is, but it's certainly going to help your visual skills today tremendously. Um, drill's called Change Lines. Riding format, like I said, is going to be no brakes, third, fourth gear. Hand signal from your coach is follow me. And your goal in this drill is to find different lines that you can still make work for you.